pork chop, poppers, a glue guy, the wrench, whatever you call him, Isaiah Whaley was a stud last year. Co-defensive player of the year in the Big East, in fact. Now he's back for his fifth year of eligibility. One final ride, and he's going to be a starter as part of a UConn front court that is incredibly deep. I'm Noah Mott. Today, let's talk about the six foot nine forward from Gastonia, North Carolina. Isaiah Whaley epitomizes player development at UConn. He's gone from a guy who barely played during Dan Hurley's first year at UConn to now a stalwart defender and the only player to start every game for UConn last season. Coach Hurley has always praised Whaley's work ethic. He fights for loose balls, plays with tremendous energy, and has added to his game each season he's been in stores. Last season, he averaged 2.6 blocks, and pairing his length with a Cook of Cook's shot blocking skills will give opposing teams nightmares in the paint. He also started to shoot threes last year, hitting eight of them on the year and shooting 35% from deep, which is pretty respectable. Three point shooting and mid range shooting off the pick and pop will be the area I think Whaley's going to grow the most in this coming season. Now, Whaley's calling card, though, is obviously his defense. He squared off against some tremendous bigs Precious Achua of Memphis, top five pick Evan Mobley of USC. Achua, February of 2020, shot a paltry 7 for 22 in a loss at the XL Center for Memphis, and Mobley was just 4 of 10 in a loss last season at Mohegan Sun. Now, I see Whaley as a starter to begin the year, and if he can maintain a high level of play and improve his free throw shooting, where he was just a 47% shooter from the line last year, he has a chance to really start all season long. Now, Cook Cook will be pushing him every day, but depth in the front court and figuring out which two of Whaley a Cook, a Cook, and Sonogo will start is really a great problem to have for UConn. Dan Hurley loves his squads to play games in the 60s. He's not going to have teams that are going to put up 80 a game, but if his team can hold the opponent to 60s, they're going to win a lot of games. Isaiah Whaley is the key to that. He is the defensive anchor. Can't wait to see the wrench back in action this year. He is truly a blast to watch. I'm Noah Mott, and on the next episode of Player Breakdowns, we'll be taking a look at a guard, Jalen Gaffney.